hello guys and welcome to this new power bi tutorial in this video i'm going to create the following interactive dashboard which is about hollywood most profitable stories as you can see here i'm going to create different charts we have bar charts we have donut charts and we have scatter plots but to first start creating our dashboard let's first explore our data set here we have our data set so you can find this link in the description to download it and as you can see here, we have 74 movies released between 2007 and 2012. And if we go down here, we have eight colors. So we have the name of the film, we have the genre, lead studio, the audience score, profitability, and also we have movie rating on Rotten Tomorrow we have worldwide growth and we have the year so now let's import our data set and start creating our charts here i have created a new project and to get our data we click on get data text csv connect load and we can see here on the right the different columns so the first chart will be a bar chart for profitability by studio so click on clustered bar chart we click on profitability and on lead studio okay so now i'm going to format that first thing that we're going to do is to change the title so we have profitability by lead studio in the center bold black and we add the border with round corners 20 for the visual the bars all will be in black and for the grid lines we select off for the y-axis same thing it will be black bold with no title and same thing for the x-axis okay so here we have our chart and we can add also the labels so the values will be outside end and bold black all right we can just okay so the next one it will be profitability by genre so copy paste this one you can put it here and instead of lead studio we have the genre so we can change the title general title it will be genre okay next we have the donut charts so same thing copy paste this one you can put it here and it will be donut chart for total movies by genre so we have genre and we have the count of the films okay now same thing i'm going to format that we start by removing the legend and for the details it will be category percent of total next we have the slices so for example you can put black next okay so for this one we can decrease it like that and so copy paste twice so one we put it here and the second one in here same thing i'm going to decrease that ok 
aquí. So this one is total films by genera. So the title it will be total films by genera. Copy this one. And this one it will be total films by year. Okay. So instead of the genera. I'm going to put the year okay and we can sort that so sort access by year and same thing we can change the colors so for slices for example 2007 put this one So it's up to you to choose the colors that you want. All right. And this one, it will be total films by lead studio. So we change the title. Total films by lead studio. Okay, so instead of the genre, we put the lead studio. And same thing, we are going to change the colors. So for the slices, we can put this one. Here we can choose the dark colors in here. All right. Next we have the scatter plots. So copy paste this one. Okay, just put it here. And we change it to scatter plot. So on the x axis, we are going to put rotten tomatoes. All right, don't summarize. And on the y axis, we are going to put the audience score. Same thing, don't summarize. And for the axis, so we add the title bold. Okay. Same thing for the y axis. And we remove the grid lines. Okay, so we can change the title. So we have the audience score. And Tomatoes. Percentage, I think. So the next one, it will be worldwide growth and on tomatoes. So same thing, copy paste this one. So it will be like that. Okay, and instead of the audience score, we have worldwide goals and don't summarize. Okay, so we can change the title. So we have worldwide goals. Okay, so if we close this one, close this one, we get our final dashboard for Hollywood most profitable stories. 
So that's it for this tutorial. I hope that you have learned new things. Thanks for watching and see you in next tutorial.